Hello my friends, welcome or welcome back. In today's video, we are going to be talking about algebraic statements and the solutions. First of all, let's not confuse algebraic expression with uh, algebraic statement. They are two things different. Okay, as we saw before, Expressions refer to when we are combining numbers and variables using addition, subtraction, multiplication, division, exponent, and root. So what is new now is that we talk about statements when we compare expressions using equal sign, creator sign, less, create or equal, less or equal symbols, right? So if I have the uh, expression one and I have expression two, comparing them with these signs equal or other signs, this whole thing will give me a statement. When we use equal symbol, in between expression, we call the statement an equation. When we use other sign, like we call the statement inequality. So if I write one plus one equal zero, even though we know that it is not correct, it's still an algebraic statement 2x minus 1 equal 5 4 plus x less than 16 square root of 3 plus 8x create or equal 12 they are all example of algebraic statements what are some questions that can be asked to us regarding algebraic statements? So we can be asked if a statement is true or false. For example, uh, 2 minus 1 equal to 3. Is it true or false? And the answer will be false. Because 2 minus 3 here will give us 1. 1 equal 3 is false, right? Another question is, we can be asked, for what value of the variable the statement is true or false? What does it mean? If I have, for instance, 3x plus 1 equal 10, for what value of x? x is my variable, is this statement true or false? So the answer will be if x equal to 3, the equation is true, right? Why? Because if I substitute, I will have 3 times 3 plus 1 equal to 10. Is 3 times 3 will give me 9. 9 plus 1 will give me 10. 10 equal to 10. True. And for what value is it false? I can choose any value. If x equal to, let's say, 2, that's false because I will have 3 times 2 plus 1 equal 10. 3 times 2 will give me 6. 6 plus 1 that's 7. So let me just put here 7 equal to 10, which is not true, right? Another question is find the solution 
of the algebraic statement and uh, in this case we are going to be using x plus 1 equal to 2 this same question here means solve the algebraic statement so find the solution means solve and in this case we want to find what value if we substitute at the place of x will give us 2. The answer is x equal 1. Because when I substitute this 1 into my x, I will have 1 plus 1 equal to 2. 1 plus 1 is 2, which is equal to this 2, which is true. So let me rewrite it here. I have 1 plus 1 equal to 2. When I add these two, I have 2 equal to 2, which is true. So my answer is else equal to 1. There are better ways for solving equalities and inequalities. We will see some in the upcoming sections. The last question we can be asked it is to determine whether a number is a solution for an algebraic statement. For example, if I have, they will give you the number. If the number is equal to, right? Is this number two solution for the statement 3x greater than 4? That will be your question. And uh, how to find the answer? You substitute the 2 by the x and you have 3 times 2 is this greater than 4? Let's solve. This side we will have 6, this side we will have 4 and uh, the same sign 6 greater than 4 that's true. So our answer is yes. The number two is solution for our statement 3x greater than 4. If you have any question, put it in the comment section. Also, subscribe, like, share, activate the notification bell so you will be notified when I upload a new content. For now, I'll see you soon.